Michelle. It's like 7 a.m., man. You're crazy. You sure I'm a lady, man? Probably oh. not. You're a monster. Yeah. <laughs> All right, come on. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, you okay. want to ride? Let's go. I'm in the car, Ma. Jason, don't forget that Sully... What is this? Sully's coming in today, and he's excited to see you. Ma, I can't. You all got to practice, and then I got... I no, don't stop with school. me, Jason. He lives all the way in California. We get to see him once or twice a year. You're gonna come home straight after practice. You're gonna hang out with him or whatever, okay? And don't forget to tell him that we are going to church on Sunday. Yo, will you stop with that stuff, please? What? I want to introduce him to the priest. No, we can still save him. He's family. Okay, get out of my room, please. All right, que yo te bendiga. What is that smell, Jason? Absolutely. Guys, did you hear the new Taylor Swift song? It's so good. I cried. So if I tell you I like Taylor Swift, you want me to give me a date with you? Maybe. I mean, she got some pretty good songs. Yeah. Oh. And she's pretty hot, too. You can't lie. <laughs> Yo, do y'all hear yourself? That is mad gay Taylor Swift. Like, what? The why heck? is that gay? Was I talking to you, homo? Huh? What? <laughs> I just want to know why it is every time everybody don't like something, it's got to be gay. We don't go around talking about every stupid thing we don't like calling it black, do we? Oh, yeah. Wait, listen, you wanna get yourself hurt. Yeah. 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 Is that what we really wanna get, get hurt, huh? Like that. Relax, man. Whatever, man. You, why you always defending this kid? Yo, I'm not. I'm just saying he didn't mean it like that. You know that. Come on. Oh, yeah, chill. Come on. All right. Babe, it was nice to stand up for him like that. Because some people here don't know how to shut up. Well, you're so lucky you're a female. Oh. Like, I swear. Pete, relax yourself, man. What's wrong with you today? You, you in a bad mood or something? Nah, man. Your girl just need to learn how to shut up. Somebody need to put a muzzle on his chick or something. Yeah. Oh, shut really? up, oh, Peter. Babe. No one here even likes you. Why don't you go smirk your busted looking yeah. self? Oh. <laughs> Forget about him. All right? All right, go on. Let's go. Look who's all grown. Hey, little cuz. How's it going? Hey, what's up, Summer? How you been? Oh, all same right. old same. You look good, Jace. Well, you been working out? Nah, that's probably just basketball, you know. I heard you were working as an extra in movies and stuff. How's, the, how's that going? It's been good. Getting little parts here and there, making good connections. It's not easy, but I love it. <laughs> I'm just working for that big role, you know? Oh, but that's enough about me. I came to see you and Michelle. I hear you got a girlfriend? Yeah, Ellie. We've been together like six months now. And what about Michelle? Is she into boys yet? I mean, last time we were here, we were playing Barbies. Michelle? Nah, she better not be bringing no boys on, man. She's 15. So? How old were you when you first started dating girls? I was 15, man, but I'm a boy. It's different. I don't want my little sister coming home crying because somebody called her a slut or something like that. Why she gotta be a slut? <laughs> what if she just fell in love with a nice boy? Nah, man, I'm good. Oh, Chill. <laughs> come on, Jay. <laughs> How about we all go shopping? N no, really. What time does Michelle get home? I can take you shopping. Go to the mall like we used to. No, I don't need anything, so. Oh, come on, let's see. Because no, you. Come on, man. Just, really just, don't go shoes. in my room. Get out of my room, man! Hey, what's wrong with you? Help me help you. It'll be fun. Are you gay and stupid, man? Come on, I'm trying to tell you. I don't want to be hanging around with some... Some what? Some fag, man. <laughs> Forget this, man. Oh, you know, God. Jason, I am gay. But I am still a man. And for the record, I am perfectly happy with who I am. Maybe you should learn how to be too, instead of trying to bring me down. Oh. 
talk you talk, you need to wait up And honestly, there ain't too much I'm afraid of You ain't nothing like me I got this girl up my back, but I say so Hello uh, <laughs> Ugh, you smell like her. Alright, would you stop? Ellie's a great girl, okay? She's important to me. Yo, I don't see why. I mean, you're gay, Jay's face it. This guy's oh, getting old. Eric. Look, I like you. A lot, alright? But I'm not gay. And whatever this is, it's, it's, it's fun, okay? And it's... It's great. Alright, but... I have a girlfriend, okay? Jason. You're here with me, aren't you? You just said you like this. You're gay, Jace. Doesn't hiding bother you? All right, look, do we have to do this right now? We have a few minutes together. All right, do we have to spend it like this? Fine. Just give me a kiss. Okay, that's enough. <laughs> okay. Oh, I'm sorry, did I hurt you? Oh Yo, what, what do you want? Mom told me that you and Sully got into it last night. That's why he left. What the hell did you do? Fuck. He said he didn't want to be where he wasn't wanted. What happened? Nothing. I just said some stupid stuff. Relax. It doesn't matter. Michelle, can I ask you a question? What, what if somebody real close to you came out of the closet? I really don't care. Why? I don't know. Just hypothetically, what if, what if like a close friend of yours said that they were gay? What would you do? Like I said, I really don't care. I want them to be happy. Dude, is Peter gay? I always thought he was way oh, too my. macho to be straight. No, not Peter. I'm asking hypothetically, like, what if, what if somebody even closer to you said it? Forget it, I'm sorry, ne never mind. just. Okay, so then why did you ask me then? What's up? Jason, are you trying to tell me you're gay? What? No, I'm not gay. What are you crazy? I'm I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All right. It's just a lot of stuff's been happening to me. Okay, and I just I don't know what to think. Well, what's going on then? I met this guy, and we we kind of. We kind of hooked up. Um, and I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know what to think. You know, I'm just, I'm freaking out a little bit. And Ellie? I love Ellie, of course. It's just, it's just stupid. I think, I think I like Eric. Eric, from school? Yes. Seriously? Eric, yes, Eric from school. My God. I can't feel that way. Who says you can't? I mean, yeah, it's probably not something you would expect, but it's okay. It's not okay, Michelle. I... I think... I think I might be gay. What if I'm gay? I'm here for you, okay, Jason? I love you. I'm here, okay? I'm here. Listening? I'm here, okay? You're not alone. Yo, we gotta talk, man. About what, man? Don't start acting dumb, all right? Mike told me he saw you and that little fag Eric chilling in the locker room during six period. Like, what's going on? What are you talking about, man? Mike's bugging out, man. I wasn't there. Really? Because Mikey don't lie. And Ellie told me and Mike that you've been acting funny lately, so it's not adding up. Like, what's going on? Yo, first of all, I got the baddest chick in school, man. I got girls around me every single day. You think I'm be hanging out with some homo man? Come on, that's not me. Really? So you calling Mikey a liar? So you wasn't there? I, just, I don't know what to tell you, man. I wasn't there. What do you want me to say? 
Don't start playing stupid, all right? Mike told me that the little fag was wrapped all around you and you ain't do nothing Yo, a lot. Whoa, first of all, if a fag was on me that tight, you think I'm gonna let him live like that? According to Mike, you did. Come on, man. Seriously, P, you get on my nerves, man. I'm telling you, you get on my nerves. I told you, I wasn't there, I wasn't there. I'm not gay, dog. I believe. All right, just forget about it. But since I ain't got to worry about you filling up on me, <laughs> you want to hang out with us after the game tomorrow? You know, Joey Cousin supposed to hook us up. Yeah, yeah, man, I can do that. Yeah, that's good. When? Where? I, I, I just see you after the game, all right? All right, man. All right. Here this time, I kind of like the locker room. Listen, Mike saw us in the locker room the other day. All right, I just figured it'd be safer if we met here. Wait, we can stop hiding now, right? Eric, why do you keep mentioning this we? There isn't an us, Eric. Listen to me, we just mess around. That's it. I'm still dating, dating Elliot. Did you forget that? I have scouts coming to see me every single day. Okay, and honestly, what college basketball team wants a homo, huh? This isn't easy for me. I have other things in my life besides you to worry about. You know what? Forget it. Just forget it. You have the perfect opportunity to tell people oh, everything. Don't do this, please. And instead you decide to keep up this bull? I'm tired of this, Jason. I love you, but I'm not going to continue to live your life. I'm not going to be your little side job you use whenever you want to get off. Stop it. I want more than hiding out in locker rooms and sneaking out at night. <laughs> I want to walk down the hallway and have you not be ashamed of me. I want to bring you home. I, I want to kiss you in public and do that. Have I you can't. not be ashamed of your friends seeing us? I want you, Jason. But without, without all these strings attached. You can't see that, Eric. No, you know what? Forget it. Just forget it. Stop, Eric. Please, Eric. I did not need it like that. Come on, damn it. Great game, baby. Let's celebrate. The girls from the squad are having this party. Everyone's going. Oh, nah, I'm not kidding. I'm still going. Well, maybe you could say maybe later on then. It's supposed to be really fun. Whenever you're not there, it has to do with these drunk guys hating on me. I just don't want to be alone. Where were you yesterday? I thought you had practice. Mike said you didn't show. Huh? I, I left earlier. My mom wanted me to talk to my cousin. Really? But when I called your house, my show said that you were at home. Yo. Yo, El, stop bugging. All right, I left practice earlier, went straight to my grandmother's house. It's when you got GPS on Well, like I mean, that. Jason, come on. You're never around anymore. What do you expect from me? You don't call me. You don't text me. I already see you. I want to know what's going Relax. on with my boyfriend. Relax. Babe, what's going on? Yo, look, I want to spend time with you. I do. I just been real busy. Then come to the party with me. I can't. Listen, next week, I don't have any games, OK? So I'll be able to chill with just me and you. All right? Fine. OK. All right, give me a kiss. All right, I got to go. That was a good game, though, right? Uh, no, right? Cool. You won, though, boy. <laughs> you did your thing, but that was all you. <laughs> Yo, what's, what's going on, guys? You said you wasn't gay, right? We'll prove it. Finish this off, Jace. We, we just helping him out, beating the fag out of him. Yo, y'all bugging, man. I'm not gonna hit him, you crazy? Well, all right, fine by me. I guess me and Mike just had to tell everyone what Mike saw. Yo, all y'all better chill, man. You relax. Homo's gonna be here any minute. It's crazy. Yo, shut up, Homo. Listen, Jace, get in here and beat the fag out of him. I ain't got no patience for this. Hey, man, wait, man, relax, man, wait, chill. Listen now, Jace. Yo, what are you talking well, about? What I want, dog? What do you want me to say, man? Come on, Jay, what choice you got? I 
I think one of the main things for my character, um, you shouldn't have to be so afraid to be who you are. And that seems something that's sort of said over and over again, but it's true. Like the reason why he doesn't come out and just allow himself to feel what he's feeling is because he's afraid of how it's gonna affect his public life, the way his friends are gonna react to him. I mean, look what happens when, when, uh, when Jolito's character thinks that he is. But then masculinity is always already seen as, you know, maleness, as aggression, as head of household, as king, and all of these sort of rhetorics says in my mind that masculinity, as we conceptualize it in culture, in our society, has everything to do with control. Basically, this world is taught um, stereotypes for a man um, because of the movies, the video games, all the stuff that they were grew up to be. So at the end of the day, they don't think it's weird. They think it's kind of right. So now maybe we should change this in the world.